What is a strainer? What is a throw off? What is a butt plate? In a nutshell, those are the pieces of the snare drum that hold on the snare wires and turn them on or turn them off. Let me show you how it works. In this day and age, a strainer and a throw off are one and the same. The word strainer came long ago, back, gosh, in the Civil War days, and that's what held on the snare wires back then in those old military drums. It wasn't until later on when drummers needed the way to play two different sounds that someone developed the throw off. And what that means, the throw off means throwing off the snare wires so you can get them on or off. Here on this DW drum, they have what they call their mag throw off. Right now the snare wires are on, throw off the lever, snare wires are now off. You've probably seen many snare drums out there that have the lever that is basically flush to the drum that goes this way. There are other brands that have the levers that go this way like the DW drum, but again, they do the exact same thing. Taking the snare wires and turning them off and or on. Now, directly on the other side of the throw off is what they call the butt plate. And that's just the other side of the throw off that holds on to the snare wires on this side. Some higher end drums have three position butt plates where you can take the snare wires and have a low, medium and high tension setting. But most of the time, they're basic like this and they just hold on the snare wires like this with a couple of tension rods. So one more time, the strainer, the throw off and the butt plate are the pieces of the snare drum that hold the snare wires on and turn them on and off. If you're interested in learning any more audio concepts like this, visit us at sweetwater.com's news and research page and check out other videos on this playlist.